Hi there, students. A hawk. To hawk. Well, the first meaning you probably know of a hawk, this is a large bird of prey, sort of like an eagle that uh, catches small birds. Yeah, it flies and then it f comes down and uh, catches a rabbit or something like this. Um, and then from this, you also get in politics. Um, somebody who is a hawk is somebody who um, supports the use of force rather than discussion or more peaceful solutions. So in Washington you have the hawks, the warmongers, and the doves, the people who uh, want to do it peaceably. Okay, so a hawk. You can also actually have this in economics as well. Um, the hawks want a strong um, uh, economic policy, strong controlling action in the budget and in, in inflation. So yeah, he's a, a, a budget hawk. I, got, I get the idea, watch somebody like a hawk. Um, then we also have the verb to hawk to sell goods informally, to sell goods in public places. Over many, on, on many doors of houses, you used to see, probably not anymore, no hawkers or circulars. So the hawkers are, would you like to buy my brushes? Yeah, and circulars, these are um, advertising, adver pieces of advertising. Um, you go to the market, there are people hawking their products, hawking their wares. Yeah, um, You can also use this maybe a bit informally. He's trying to hawk his idea, to sell me his idea. Um, he's uh, hawking this, his project around, uh, uh, around uh, upper management to see if he can drum up some support. So a hawker, somebody who sells goods informally. Yeah, somebody who's fly pitching. Come and buy it, it's the best. Okay, that's definitely hawking. Okay, to to hawk. Um, okay, yes, there is one other meaning as well. Um, if you're plastering a wall, making a wall flat, you have a tool which has a handle and a flat surface. And that is also called a hawk. A mortar board, yeah, and you take it off and you, you sp uh, use it to uh, flatten your wall. That's a hawk. Okay, so quite a few, quite a few meanings there. A hawk, a bird of prey, hawks and doves. Somebody with um, a an aggressive uh, political. Uh, they advocate ag aggressive political positions, aggressive actions. Yeah, um, then you have, um, okay, to hawk, to try and sell something by shouting out in the street. Oh, I missed another one, another meaning as well. To hawk, <coughs> yeah, is to bring phlegm, to, uh, the, to cough something up out of your throat, to clear your throat, yeah. Um, my grandfather sat on, sat outside hawking uh, as he uh, put more tobacco in his pipe, yeah, to clear your throat. One of the bands I really like is Hawkwind, and the origin of the name Hawkwind comes from hawk <coughs> and wind, well, to pass wind, and that was the idea of it, uh, of the name. Okay. Um, so going back to hawk, to sell something by shouting out or to pedal, to go from place to place. He's always uh, uh, going along our street trying to hawk his, uh, uh, his products. Uh, people in the market shouting out, come and buy it, come and buy it, it's the cheapest ever. He's hawking, yeah, to sell something for sale. Well, then you could hawk an idea. Yes, to uh, mm, try to interest somebody in, in an idea. Okay, so lo lots of meanings there. Um, yeah, let's see. As to, uh, as to formality, so the hawk, the bird, are five in formality. 
hawks and doves. I think probably five informality. Again, I think you could use it informally or in a very uh, formal um, writing. The plasterer's tool, again, I think maybe five informality, use it anywhere. I think it's a rather technical word. Um, to hawk goods, to hawk your wares. Um, yeah, no hawkers or circulars. I think I'm going to give it another five. A regular verb. He, he has hawked his, his goods. He has hawked goods all his life. Yeah, Del Boy out of Old Fools and Horses. He's a real hawker. He's trying always trying to hawk, hawk his dodgy gear. Um, and then to hawk as in... <coughs> um, it's probably a, a less common word. Um, although, yeah, I'm going to give it again a five in uh, formality to expectorate. That's a good, a good word for that. Okay, so let's let's try going through these again. Okay, so the uh, the, the large bird, uh, which is uh, a hunter. Um, let's see, there was an old English word, haffock, um, and that actually goes back to uh, Proto-Germanic, uh, habukaz, which I also think is a hawk or a bird of prey. Um, then we have the, the, the hawk as well, as in the political hawk, it's from the, sa the same root. Um, the plasterer's tool comes from uh, ash and axe, yeah? Uh, and, well, yeah, a, a sort of tool, I suppose. Um, the hawking sound, I think this one's onomatopoeia. Yeah. yeah. That it's it sounds like what it means. It's on a, it comes from uh, the meaning, and then a hawker um, to hawk your wares comes from uh, a Proto-Germanic word, ho has, meaning to mock, to insult, or to uh, ridicule. Okay, so to hawk a bird. In politics, and somebody who believes in aggression more than peaceful diplomacy. To hawk goods, yeah, hawking trinkets, to peddle, to sell, to push. Yeah, and somebody's hawking something. They're trying to sell something in a forceful way. Um, and then to hawk, <coughs> yeah, to clear your throat, to expectorate. And then this hawk, a plasterer's tool as well. Wow, what a lot of meanings. Enough. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating. This is where I get to hawk my words. Uh, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you soon. Bye for now. Hawk.